<sighs> it's always something. At least that's one more crisis averted. For now. It never stops, does it? <sighs> I know you're there. What do you want? It's late, and I'm in the middle of something. What are you doing wandering around the compound at this hour? You should be sleeping. You know tomorrow's going to be non-stop once we set out. I can't afford to babysit you on tomorrow's mission because you're too tired. What are you, my nanny? Ay, por Dios, you've actually started to master the art of annoying me. It's almost impressive how talented you are at this. Are we done here? <laughs> I'm still up because there's work to do. Don't tell me you're here to lecture me. Lila's pestered me enough as it is. You'll get the same response she did. Back off. I don't have the luxury to stop. Besides, I can handle a few sleepless nights, all right? Are we done here? Turn. But I'm fine. No, I can't afford to have limits. I'm used to facing problems on my own, and if you have a problem with that, Ugh. What? Are you trying to play therapist now? Maybe, instead of looking out for the greater good, I should take a minute to talk about my feelings all because you're worried about me. We've got a guy for that. In fact, there's someone for most of the jobs we need taken care of, so let me do mine. This is how I operate. I'm more than willing to work with the team, but I'm much more used to working alone. This won't be my first all-nighter, and I don't plan on it being my last. Do you get that? <sighs> Look, I... I get that you're looking out for me. It's my responsibility to stay on top of things. To manage the system so that nothing goes wrong while the others make sure it doesn't get any worse. So I have to do this. No matter the cost. Stressing yourself out over it won't benefit anyone. Not me, and definitely not you. It's... better this way. I... <sighs> I wouldn't wish this burden on anyone. Day in, day out. Always looking for the ways that things can go wrong. And sometimes, they do. After that, it isn't as if I have the luxury of moving on and forgetting. No. It goes on to serve as a reminder of my mistakes. <sighs> Even if I wanted to sleep, I doubt I could find rest at this point. Why should I even bother? Scanning over these minute details always leaves me too anxious to sleep. Guess that comes with having to keep up with so much at once. In that case, I can admit that it's a lot to take on. Even for me. You happy? Of course not. You're stubborn that way. Fine. You win. 
I'll take a break. Only for tonight, though. Yeah, yeah. As long as you promise not to make a big deal out of it. Don't get used to having your way all the time. Even if I don't want to admit it. You've made some good points. I was placing the blame on you when ignoring my signs of exhaustion could pose the same risks. In that way, yes. I guess you told me so. Now give me a few more minutes to monitor this possible anomaly. Things been bothering me for hours. Look, I promise to go to my quarters once I check this off the list. You don't need to stick around for the boring stuff. What? Why did you web up there? Wait, are you trying to look intimidating right now? What? Are you going to make me go to my room? Are you serious? Where do you think you're going? I agreed to take a break, so why are you walking away? Is this because you wanted me to drop everything at this second? Now come on! I was leaving going to help you get your way. And don't try giving me a hard time for climbing on the ceiling. We wouldn't be up here if it weren't for you. Don't tell me you expected me to let you walk away. I know you're only looking out for me. We can argue till we're both blue in the face, but you're coming from a selfless place. It isn't something I would let myself forget. I've been harsh with you lately. Even if overwork is the reason. I don't want to rely on excuses. I was wrong to lash out when you're trying to help. Let me make it up to you. Name it. Whatever you want. <laughs> A kiss? Right now? Here? All right. Sure. I'm calling you out on your bluff. That's all. If you really think you can get me to do what you want, then you better have the confidence to back it up. We're the good guys, after all. We don't tell lies, right? And you would never lie to me. No. You care about me too much for that. You've made that very clear. I can tell. Even if I am hanging from the ceiling and you're still wearing that mask. You're not the only one paying attention here. I can bet you don't look as assured as you're acting under there. See, you give me a hard time as it is. So I figured it's time I matched your energy. You know? I'm starting to think that little stunt of walking away was just that. You were banking on me following. Except, now that I fell for that little game of yours, you have no idea what to do now. But I've got you. There you are, cariño. Come here. Hey, now. Where'd all that bluster from before go? You sounded smug when you asked for this. Don't tell me you're nervous all of a sudden. <clears throat> That's 
More like it. But I'm not done yet. Pretty sure you've managed to pull me away from work. For tonight, at least. Like I said, don't get used to it. You're smart, but you can't win every time. Well, what are you waiting for? Aren't you going to make sure I make it to my room? You heard me. Without you keeping an eye out, what's stopping me from turning around? It's best to be thorough and see things to the end. <laughs> 